Welcome to What's New in Autodesk Revit Structure 2010. My name is Scott Hammond, Marketing Readiness Manager for Structural Engineering. There are three main themes for Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 software, including modeling analysis, user interface enhancements, and performance and interoperability. Throughout the rest of the presentation, you will see all of these new features and improved functionality and how they relate to these themes. Bridge modeling, steel construction modeling, and conceptual form analysis capabilities are only available to subscription customers. Slanted columns are becoming more and more common in larger high profile projects. The architectural forms that engineers are being required to support are getting more and more complex. Engineers and drafters can now create slanted columns using the same column families they have used for vertical columns, which include not only physical characteristics, but also analytical. The columns can be created in either 3D or in framing elevations. There is a new column style parameter that is applied to all slanted columns. By default, slanted columns are endpoint driven, which means if the column end offset is adjusted, the angle of the column will be modified to account for the new endpoint vertical location. Angle-driven slanted columns will maintain the angle at which they were created when an end offset is modified, and the endpoint location will adjust along the angle of the plane. The new conceptual form tools provide an easier and intuitive way to create complex forms inside of Autodesk Revit Structure software. These forms can be created using simple forms such as extrusions, sweeps, revolves, and so on. However, they can then be easily manipulated and can also include constraints and rules for more control. The toolset provided to create these forms helps give users the flexibility to work using global coordinates for easier modeling of complex structures. Use splines with points to manipulate surfaces that are NURB-like with complex doubly curved surfaces. X-ray mode allows users to modify points along surfaces in an environment that incorporates control and visualization. Once the forms are complete, use tools such as divide, pattern, and panelize to define surface panels and to define nodes. All of these complex form tools are enhanced with an improved sketching environment work intuitively in 3D with reference planes and automatic work plane detection. Customers who are currently on subscription for Autodesk Robot Structural Analysis Professional 2010 software and Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 software can benefit from a new Revit extension for Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 that helps provide structural engineers with the flexibility to perform preliminary analysis on complex forms created by architects earlier in the design process. Forms created using the new conceptual design tools can be opened directly in the Revit extension and engineers can define information such as support conditions, structural loads, and load combinations. They can then perform an analysis on the shape and view critical information such as stresses and deflections for any given loads. Engineers can quickly modify constraints and supports inside of the extension and quickly rerun the analysis. By performing this simulation earlier in the process, engineers can be better informed and involved in critical decisions earlier in the design process instead of later, when changes are time consuming and more costly. Another extension available to Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 subscription customers is an enhanced tool for bridge modeling. With the addition of new bridge family content made available for Autodesk Revit Structure 2009 software, bridge engineers and designers can use this extension to more quickly and efficiently model parametric bridge structures. Road alignments can be imported via Land XML directly from the civil engineer to help ensure a more coordinated bridge structure with the road defined by the civil engineer. available for Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 subscription customers is a tool for modeling typical 3D connections. This extension will allow drafters and engineers to define components required for beam column end plate connections 
or column-based connections. And the extension will automatically create the connection using 3D components. Ribbon interface has been redesigned from the ground up to optimize Autodesk Revit Structure software for more efficient efficiency and better productivity. The task-based design of Ribbon means that users select objects to work on. They are presented with the most commonly used tools in the Ribbon. This minimizes the number of clicks needed to perform a task and presents even experienced users with some of the less commonly used tools in a clear manner. The new Autodesk Revit Structure user interface is both customizable and extensible so that customers can continue to create an environment that works the way that meets their company and industry standards. This new ribbon also includes a dedicated Analyze tab with all of the pertinent settings engineers need to create a consistent analytical model, check for required supports, and add boundary conditions or add structural loads. The application menu in the upper left corner of Autodesk Revit Structure Display has been streamlined to provide an easier access to common tools. You can create, open, save, print, and publish Autodesk Revit Structure files, send the current drawing as an email attachment, and produce electronic transmittal sets. In addition, you can perform drawing maintenance such as audit and purge and close drawings. A search tool at the top of the application menu enables you to query the quick access toolbar application menu, and the currently loaded ribbon to locate commands, ribbon panel names, and other ribbon controls. Buttons at the top of the application menu provide easy access to the recent or open documents. And a new option in the recent documents list enables you to sort by access date in addition to size, type, and ordered list. As you work with other Autodesk software, you will find that the items in the application menu are consistent, allowing you to move between programs more smoothly. In this release of Autodesk Revit Structure Software, you can get quick access to the commands you use most through the new access, Quick Access Toolbar, or QAT, which can be customized to include your favorite and most frequently used tools. Tool tips have been integrated consistently throughout the design environment, giving you helpful hints about how to use these tools with Autodesk Revit Structure Software without leaving your project. With rollover functionality, multi-level support, and context-sensitive behavior embedded in the user interface, you will likely find it easier to locate the tools you need so you can work faster. The new Info Center will direct users to help information specific to their search string, as will Autodesk Online Information, giving users more information at their fingertips. Using Autodesk Seek Web Service, users can find and share online content such as families and components all laid, located in one place. Access to the Autodesk Revit model via the API include family creation and modification. Through the API, users have access to the new conceptual design features we talked about previously as well as access to families. One of the major improvements is the ability to automate family creation via the API. realizes that projects you are being asked to design are becoming bigger and more complex, and teams are more and more likely spread apart over multiple offices. Improvements to Autodesk Revit Structure software include the ability to design larger, more complex models without breaking up the model, and the ability to take advantage of all of the RAM on a computer. This version of Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 is a native 64-bit application to be used with 64-bit operating systems such as Microsoft Windows XP Professional 64-bit or Microsoft Windows Vista 64-bit Business Home Premium Ultimate Editions. The 64-bit version of Autodesk Revit Structure 2010 removes the 4-gig memory limitation found in 32-bit applications, which enables the software's capability to handle large projects.